okay we're here with DS of uh, Garmin, Charlie Regalius. Now I've just uh, read, started reading your book. Right. Very nice. Something a little bit different. Yeah. What made you write that then? I think that uh, the kind of job that a domestic does is something that people could enjoy having explained to them a bit more in detail. You know, I think that it's a uh, sort of quite a fascinating role in the sport that a lot of people don't understand in depth. Because you, you had a relatively long career, mm. plus uh, really th this was all prior to cycling in the UK becoming massive. Yeah. So you weren't weren't known in the UK. Did you like that? Uh, I, I don't know if I liked it or not, but things are a lot different, you know, in cycling now in England. And uh, I think I was a bit underground, you know, a bit lost behind en enemy lines. So part of the way it goes isn't it and then you went over to the states to ride for united healthcare for your last season yeah. what was it what was that why did you do that then just fancy a different scene or no i just couldn't find a spot in a world tour team so i had to have a look around me that's the that's the open and shut of it so. and then you've ds here yeah how's life different there do you have to room with people still or do you get no, your own room hairy legs <laughs> fat hairy legs <laughs> see you dave thank you mate yeah, it's different. Different kind of stress, different kind of excitement, longer days. Not as good suntan? No, uneven suntan. Uneven? Yeah, only, One the, arm, only the left arm. Have you, uh, have you had the, the, the driving skills where you've got to learn to drive with one knee, hand up bottles, read a magazine, yeah. all that all at the same time? It gets a bit racy at times, but uh, we manage all right. Okay, you live in Finland, is that correct? That's right, yeah. It's, uh, I bumped into a few guys yesterday. The finish is certainly, uh, I used to live with guy, awesome, but they're, they're uh, certainly different. They're doing um, the tour on kick bikes. Kick, oh wow. Yeah. Yeah. Is, it, is there like much of that, that over there? I, I know, I, never, I don't even know what a kick bike looks like. It's usually a bit icy for that there, so maybe that's why they're here. It is. It, what's it like for training there? Flat. Flat. Quiet, not much traffic, but it's pretty uh, sort of uh, mundane uh, routes for a bike rider. Do you speak the language? And if so, did you talk to? I'm sorry, the the name <laughs> leaves me uh, on Francis de Jour. UC Vaikanen. UC Vaikanen. I speak it. Swedish, but I don't speak Finnish. Right. So there's two languages in Finland. How many languages do you speak then? Uh, six and a half. Six. Oh, the usual sort for a Brit then. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. Thank you ever Take so care. much. Cheers. Cheers.